Welcome back, Union. As time goes by, the exit of Brexit keeps getting more unrealistic. But this wouldn't be the internet if we didn't spend the time on unnecessarities and hypotheticals. Today we are going to highlight three ways on how Brexit could be stopped. First up, Article 50 is getting revoked. Article 50 is the official Breaking the Habit EU document on how a member state could leave the EU. The European Commission made it very clear that, in the end, Article 50 is irreversible. However, an extension of the negotiations could give the Brits just enough time to rethink their bullshit and believe me when I say that they need time. I mean, just last week one of the Brexit dream boys, Nigel Farage, Sexiest Man Alive 2016, tried to quote the infamous Article 50 ending with a full stop. But oh look, the original document, where you'll find a comma and the important second half to this incomplete quote. Moving on. Secondly, Brexit could be stopped through an election in Britain. Hmm. Sounds familiar? Because it just happened a few months ago when Britain voted this scarecrow into power. Looking at those past years, you get the feeling Brits vote more often than DJ Khaled says his name in his own songs. The author of Article 50, Lord Kerr, claims that by this time next year, Britain would bleed it out and see a bad Brexit deal. I would expect that deal to carry into the House of Commons and then there would have to be an election. See, Kerr thinks an election would lead to the EU granting an extension of the Article 50 timescale and it would be perfectly possible that there would be a referendum in the first half of 2019. Last but not least, should the Labour Party gain power and would be committed to remain, Brexit could be stopped. Did you notice the should, would, and could in this sentence? Now you know how likely that's gonna be. Labour leader and dentist denier, Corbyn, feels numb when it comes to Brussels and has shown little efforts to hashtag remain. Corbyn sees Brussels as a scam against working people. And to gain an answer to this statement, as an investigative journalist, we go live right now to call Brussels headquarters for answers. No answer yet. Across this new divide and polarizing sides, I'm sure the UK won't ridicule itself again. And with all that should, would and could, a halt to Brexit seems more unlikely by the day. However, where there's a will, there's a way. Tell them, Donald. Some of my British friends have even asked me whether Brexit could be reversed and whether I could imagine an outcome where the UK stays part of the EU. I told them that, in fact, the European Union was built on dreams that seemed impossible to, to achieve. So, who knows? You may say, I am a dreamer, but I am not the only one.